Hi everyone, and in this video we will be analysing a more complex Rankine power cycle. The power cycle that we'll be looking at is what we call the Rankine regeneration cycle. It involves two sets of compressions, an isobaric heat addition, two sets of expansions which occur simultaneously, and finally an isobaric heat rejection. So in terms of the machinery involved, we begin at a pump where the pressure of the water is increased, hence there is a work into the system here. It then op enters an open feed water heater, which expels the water at state 3, wherein it enters another pump and work is put into the system. Then it enters the boiler, where heat is put into the system, and it exits the boiler at state 5, wherein it enters the turbine. And then in the turbine, an interesting thing happens. For the regeneration cycle, what happens is at the turbine, some of the fluid or some of the gas is split into some into the open feed water heater and into the condenser respectively. So we denote state six as the part that is as uh, as the uh, fluid that is introduced.